Five minutes. Thank you for being here, Ms. Kim. I appreciate it. I am from the great state of Michigan, and many of our um, my constituents are very concerned with um, transparency and integrity. So, with the state of Michigan, um, real quickly, what is the mission of the SBA? What's your mission statement? Um, we're here to support small businesses, ma'am. Here to support small businesses. Mm -hmm. Wonderful. Have you yourself ever ran a small business, owned a small business? Uh, I've worked in small businesses. I've not owned a small business. Okay. Yep. Thank you. Um, and what qualifications do you have? I was a little vague on that as a small business owner. Um, well, my job is to oversee our 10 regional and 68 district offices, and I have overseen field offices for the majority of How my career. How does that correlate with running uh, and helping people get a small business loan? Uh, well, my job is to support the field offices. Uh, my job is not to run a small business. Obviously. Obviously. Yeah. Um, do you think it would be helpful if you ran a small business to understand what it's like? I mean, I'm not a doctor, nor I play one on TV, but I don't fake it. Um, well, I did work in a small business for four years, okay. Congresswoman. Um, and, you know, I think it was a small business run, um, you know, by a family, family-owned business. And I definitely got a lot of experience. So that qualifies kind of you to be in charge? Um, I think it's my 18 years of running field offices that qualifies me to run the field office. I would agree with you. Running the field office is fantastic. Very similar to running the field office for voter registrations. So I want to pick up on one other thing. Is there anywhere in the SBA's mission that talks about voter registration being part of that mission? Um, not specifically, no. Not specifically. Thank you. Well, my colleague Eli Crane asked you a question um, about where the programs were run past, right? And I think, if I can quote, we ran programs everywhere. Was that your answer? Um, I can't remember exactly what I said, but I think I indicated we run programs across all of our 68 districts. Okay. Um, yeah. Can we take a look at Michigan, since this is what we're talking about? Sure. Okay. Just... These are facts. So since you don't know where they're at, I happen to. These are the programs that have been run by the SBA in Michigan, right? I don't know if you can see that, but all of these programs here have been run in Michigan. Southeastern, lower, you see, you see these? Make sense? Well, I can't exactly see it, but I was, uh, I believe, shown this map when I briefed the committee staff in May. Okay. Um, any idea what demographic, political party-wise, these represent? Um, I, I'm not tracking that, and I think I, I clarify. So let me help you. They're Democrat, right? Interestingly enough, how many, just out of curiosity, in the non-democratic regions of the state of Michigan that you've actually done, how many Republican areas of of your department? How, how, many, how many events have you run to open small businesses in non-democratic areas? Um, well, there's a couple of things I would offer to answer that question. One is looking I for a number in Michigan, and if you don't know it, I'll accept an I don't know. Well, I clarified with the committee staff that those events on that map are not all SBA run events. I think I'm not sure, but I because I didn't see the list from. Well, here, the here's the beauty of it. I from. realize you're not sure. The beauty of it is I'm actually sure. So let me help you. Right? Right? As a small business owner, that when I come to testify, I would think you'd know your data, but again, that's crazy. Notice any in this region up here? Um, I cannot see the map that clearly, but I don't maybe, see it. Maybe, but... maybe I can help. Yes. See this green thing here? Can you see green? I see green, yes. Bingo! That's one! <laughs> one! Republican area! One! Isn't that ironic to you, or is that just coincidental? Um, I don't manage where the district offices do their events specifically. District directors have what the do leeway. you manage? Um, I mean, Voter registration uh, in no. democratic areas. Um, we are, as part of implementing the executive order, implementing a nonpartisan resource you know what I for call, small businesses. You know, it's not nonpartisan non because if it was, does this look nonpartisan to you? Just uh, share with me. Does that look nonpartisan? Democrat. Republican. Now, me, I, 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 I understand data because I've run a small business. Does that look nonpartisan to you? 
Um, again, I think I tried to clarify with the committee. I'm staff asking that a that question. That does not actually represent all of the. Does FDA's this look nonpartisan to you? You're a smart woman. I mean, my goodness gracious, Dan, what's she in charge of? Six hundred people. I think you can answer a question. Does this look nonpartisan to you? Again, I don't think that map represents all of SBA's activities. Okay, in the state then of I will Michigan. accept your map. Do you have one? Uh, no, oh, I didn't no, come with a map. Oh no, I don't. I yield back. Thank you. The chair now recognizes Chairman Williams from Texas for five minutes. Thank you, Madam Chair, and uh, 